Hey all, Joshua Blaze here. Um, throw the timer on. Okay, uh, let's do another little installment of weight shift. Um, I don't know what to do now. Um, and yeah, we'll see where where it takes us. We'll try to make make some decisions different than the ones we made before. I definitely want to let let the girl take the car this time. I think to do that, I need to ignore the sound. When the guy falls, I need to ignore it and not, and just let her take the car. I think that's what we have to do. And when we do that, he'll take her hostage. I think maybe because she'll go out to around where the car is and then. Um, She'll find herself in his clutches, and then maybe we can rescue her. After that, I want to make clever decisions, kind of similar Someone to the ones I made last time, time, but then deviate a little. But I want to pick mostly the best options when I have the other choice. Selfish. Oh, it does say a slightly different thing. Help. <laughs> and that way we get the train. It's pretty cool. If we if we if we tried to ignore him, then we'd miss the train. <laughs> Playing this game again and again. I like going through it. I like the ride. Um, and at some point, I can play around with it, turning the volume off or something, and you know, kind of half playing if I need to, if I get bored bored enough by doing the same thing over and over again. There's only two cars out, right? Logged. Eh, I don't know what that means. There's only two cars out, out there in the garage right now, I think, is what they're saying. And the rest are, are stored away somewhere. No, no, there's, there's plenty of cars in the lot. But yeah. Whatever you there's two cars out. Oh yeah, the two cars not not in the car bring a lot. <laughs> he likes sitting in the cars. Pretending he's gonna run off and steal it. Really clever way. I like that. At the end, it says, "You are your decisions." I like that. I like that concept. I, I want to keep that in my life to keep in mind that, like, as I make decisions, I'm becoming that. Yeah, I, I believe in that philosophy. 
uh, and I really like um, that little moment there you have no choice but to make a mistake and then it's sort of like a tutorial seriously saying don't do that again make the right decisions of course there's still all kinds of things that we have no choice about that he'll do on instinct of course you want something I want to just say yes this time. She's pretty. Let's give her the keys to the car. That was easy. <laughs> yeah. Well. Aww. Uh, well, yeah, let's try to leave things on a good note here. And yeah, never mind, because if we check the CCTV. I think if we check the CCTV, we can't let her take the car. Anything else? Yeah. Back here by one, not a minute later. Ah, we're helpless. We had a pretty girl in front of us. Uh oh. We fucked up. Um, go there. Forget the pepper for spray. We always have pepper spray and it never works. I wonder if there's any way we can ever use the pepper spray. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. So we'll go over and save the girl, hopefully. Okay. Yeah. Did he kill her? <laughs> Maybe I should have said no. I bet, I bet we could have had like a more heroic option there. If we'd said no. Does it look like I can try? You get behind the wheel. Let's drive you out. That's exactly what you're going to do. Okay, maybe we should run away again this time. Yeah, because we've already seen we've already seen this when we don't run away. Run. <laughs> and this time we will refuse to get in the car, but I think they'll just take us at gunpoint anyway.
No, thank you. <laughs> Run! <laughs> yeah, it's not working out. <laughs> okay, after this, we'll start um, picking best decisions, I think, as best we can. We've already seen most of these decisions, so we don't need to. Uh... I'm, I'm a <laughs> I didn't notice it this, the first time that I did that, but it, it was really suspicious how, I mean, I, I knew he was the guy, but it was really fast, suspicious how fast his car pulled up to him. <laughs> He's like, hey, let me give you a ride, and it's like, why did you drive up here so fast? Uh, it's like pretty cool, pretty cool moment. I'm definitely gonna stop playing after this video. You can tell he likes her like as soon as he said that. He's sort of. Like he shouldn't have said anything, but couldn't help but t speak when he saw her. <laughs> it's right full, I love it. I love these guys, they're great. The dialogue was different. So I don't know how that why why it wound up so different. Cause either way, both times, both times, he came, he got here the same way. I think there were some other options here that I haven't played out yet. Um, I have to try and figure that out.
I think there's an option where you say no. Last time I didn't have it. Because of something about what I tried to do when I when I clicked steal away, I think. So I think I'm gonna try to sabotage them by setting the alarm off this time. I don't think it'll help much though. I'm getting a little bored of listening to this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna watch a little bit of my show while I skim through this part. So, putting the volume down, putting my show on. Actually, let's just stop here, and um, next time that I play, I'll throw on the show for a little bit. Um, and make like a little skimming. No, I guess I could do... Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I have a picture, a mental picture of what I want to do next time. Which is that I want to... Um, I want to... Do a short video where I'm, you know, skimming, skimming the parts that I know too well, and then uh, ending the short video when I get to the interesting parts. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that next time though. For now, we're gonna save video clip and we're gonna stop here. So, bye everybody. Save video clip.